What well, going people? So by now, everybody knows that Teddy Brockshot family, friends and in business partner created a GoFundMe page zine because basically they must say they want to help with the funeral and stuff like that and also they want to help for kind of maintain a certain lifestyle for the kids them. And you know say they have three kids, one that's three years old and they have a set of twins, girl twins, I don't even think they reach one year old yet. Could be wrong but I don't think they reach one, I think they're a couple months old. But anyway people, it surprised me to see the way how people are react towards this whole GoFundMe page. I see a lot of persons that say, um, Teddy Brookshot people, they must scam. They must look to see if the money where him have and make people bury him and this and that. Now me personally, don't know if him bankrupt or not. You understand what I say people, but the family reach out and I mean, I guess them never expect to get such a backlash because a whole heap of people are bound them out. And when I say whole heap of people, me mean whole heap of people but it surprised me to see how so much people turn upon them because when the man passed away them did a show whole heap of support now the people them put up GoFundMe page most of them same set of people that turn upon them you understand what I say but I understand where some people are come from still in a zine you know you have people who use GoFundMe as a scam but at the same time maybe he's bankrupt maybe he not have no money whole heap of people me see on Instagram I go on and I flex like them have money them don't have money believe me people who can get fooled by some people putting up things throwing up fake money and all of them something they see in the other day teddy brookshot did put up a video where him did have a whole heap of money in a one i don't think it was a briefcase i think it was a bag you understand what i say and maybe people go see all them something there and things say yeah him rich and then we see people are coming say him have a business in a canada and stuff like that but to be honest i don't know if the family does try and maintain a certain type of lifestyle or really and truly after the kids why them want the money you understand because them say so might go towards financial and so might go towards um, the kids them future it's a sad situation for see how so much people come out and I bash them but at the same time you know say so go fund me kind of get abused a whole heap of time where people scam people and all of them thing there but as me say me is a person when no say the way how somebody act on Instagram and go and like say them have money and real life are two different thing you understand look for R Kelly R Kelly barely have money the other day if he do certain things when him did in a problem well not did him still in a problem but him barely did have money for even bail out himself out of, out of jail you understand what I say and look for R Kelly Teddy Brookshot yes him coming in a few movies but the people that act like say Morgan Freeman or Denzel Washington where filthy rich or whatever me now say him shouldn't have a money put on or whatever you know. but at the end of the day me not feel like he's as rich as all some of the people them make it to be you see me the comments them what me I see just really make me shake my head I'm not telling a lie but you know how people stay they will support you but you see the minute you come up with money at this so you and them kick off because guess what a man can come and preach to you and you and him talk good enough but you see the minute him all out something and say left something with me now or offering or whatever that's the minute when you turn upon him people just not like donate money or them really just feel like say the family are try you know scam the people him but them reach over $10,000 so far, you understand? By now, them probably reach about $12,000 or $13,000. So, I think them have like, what, $17,000 more to go. Teddy Brookshot did have a whole heap of top friends, as me say, all of the big rappers them. And you don't know all of the top people them from DJ Kelly go right down. So, I feel like, say, them are going to reach that goal. Even if enough of the people them not with it, you understand? And the people them were not with it, when you have to donate, the people them just say, when you share it, if you don't want to share it, then you can keep it to yourself. But people more ask you a serious question. You feel like say, this GoFundMe thing is a scamming thing, or you really feel like say, they don't have any money for bury him and so forth. Me personally feel like say them have a little change, but them a try to preserve it. You understand what I mean? So that's just my personal opinion. And them would have just want the assistance of the fans and people out there so that them not have to touch the money there, isn't it? But the GoFundMe page is there. So whoever wanna go donate can go donate and it is what it is, you see me. Anyway, viewers and subscribers, leave in the comments and make me know where anything about this. Until me drop the next video, I'm out. Psycho. Just got a whole lot of bullets, but I never insure my gun to Geico.